Hey guys, what's up? It's Candace here. Um, I just had LASIK eye surgery on Saturday, so it's been about 48 hours since I um, had my eyes lasered. So that's why I don't have any eye makeup on. Um, I am planning on hopefully filming a video for you guys maybe tomorrow about my experience with LASIK eye surgery. Um, I'm just kind of waiting to get like all the details right before I film a video. So I thought in the meantime I would post a video today uh, because I did want a video like every Sunday is what I'm trying to do. So um, I'm going to do my Ipsy bag review. So this came in the mail today. I haven't done one of these in a long time. Um, for a while I never like renewed my subscription with Ipsy. Uh, just because I, I don't know, I just, I don't really have a reason why I never did it. I love Epsi, it's just I never had time to, but I just did renew it. So this is the January Epsi bag, and it is perfect since I just had LASIK eye surgery, and the theme is called All Eyes on You, so I just thought that was really funny. This bag is super cute, so it's got these little women with glasses on, and the back is just blue, and it has like a really bright... Uh, yellowish green highlighter color for the zipper so you open it up and um, if you don't know what Ipsy is I'll kind of tell you um, basically it's a monthly subscription they give you a makeup bag and it has five I think products about five products uh, in there they're usually sample size products uh, with a few full size so a uh, really good thing it's ten dollars a month for these bags. So the first thing I got in my bag, and everybody gets different things if you aren't aware what Ipsy is. This really fine brush, um, it's called a smudger brush. So I guess um, this would be when I can wear makeup. It would be good for like a, maybe like a crease or smudging some eyeliner on. But it's a really, really small brush, so this is pretty cool because I do not have a really small smudger brush like that. Next, I have this, which is Advanced Peptide Eye Complex. So, it's a, it's basically for under your eyes. I'm not really sure what it is. I already opened this bag and I tried to read it, but it didn't really say what it does. It just says apply under eyes um, daily so not sure what it is it's probably just to uh, help make your skin under your eyes be healthy so that is this the next thing I have is some I think I'm guessing it's just like eyeshadow and it's from Pixie by Petra I've never heard of this brand actually they gave me, uh, I haven't even opened this yet, they gave me some really pretty colors, uh, it has like, kind of, it looks right now like a red one, and like a sparkly brown color, so let's open this up and see, and as I'm opening this, I'll talk about my next pro product. This is called a Sugar Lip Scrub by Hannah, I don't know how to say that. Um, but, uh, I have no idea what a sugar lip scrub is for. I've never even heard of a sugar lip scrub, but as I was reading this, it says it's supposed to help moisturize your lips, and you put it on, uh, you put on your lips, and then you're supposed to wash it off your lips, so if you open up, it's just, it looks like this, so I haven't even put it on yet, ooh, so, it's like a exfoliator for your lips. Very moisturizing. Wow. It tastes very good. <laughs> I don't know if you're supposed to eat it, but it does taste like sugar. So it's definitely sugar that's in there. But, wow, that is super moisturizing. And uh, this is... I feel like I've had a product by them before, this Pixie by Petra before. I don't know why I feel like I've had it. So it's kind of like a maroon color and then a 
pretty little brown sparkly color so I'll do some swatches for you guys oh wow the brown the brown one is very pigmented and it's um my camera will focus and it's not gonna focus that's okay so this brown is very pigmented but then this maroon you can see right on this finger the maroon's not that pigmented not as pigmented as the brown but it's still like a really pretty color for your eyes so as soon as I can wear eye makeup I feel like this is gonna be a really good eyeshadow and then the final thing I have in my bag is I'm guessing oh it is it's a mist by Mr. White and I'm guessing it's brown eyeliner I haven't even opened this yet either when you can't open something use your teeth right <laughs> okay I'm gonna open this really quickly come on eh. on my tongue well but that is this stuff is really it smells good tastes good any thoughts on this ipsy bag Sometimes I get stuff in my Ipsy bag that I'm never gonna use, never do use. I hate when they give me like creams like this because I end up giving it to my mom. Or it sit in my room and I never use it. I wish there was a way to tell them, please don't send me any creams. I'm opening like the wrong end. I'm sorry you guys that you have to watch me open this. Wow, so it's very hard to open if you were wondering. Okay, there we go. I got most of the plastic off. That's good enough for you guys to see. So it's a brown eyeliner. It looks brown. Let me do a swatch. Very pigmented. <laughs> I barely had to do a swatch. I don't know what I'm going to use brown eyeliner for. I guess you could like uh, do under your waterline. I'd have to look up YouTube videos on people who do makeup with a brown eyeliner but um doesn't come off so that's good because I like my makeup to be pretty waterproof but seems like a good liner it's just I don't really wear brown so this is this liner it's called Mr. Right now it's, sorry my camera doesn't want to focus but yeah that's what came in my ipsy bag um very good company I just haven't uh haven't used them in a while just because no reason no specific reason so very happy with all the products thank you guys so much for watching please uh, check out my future videos and subscribe to my channel I plan to talk about my LASIK eye surgery in a future video hopefully tomorrow I'm not making any promises but I will see you guys in my next video bye